Now at this point, I'm about ready to place this onto the can. Um, I, uh, I, I mentioned that I cracked this little piece of uh, shelf that I made right here, but I just stuck some glue on there and re-glued it. I'm going to let that dry before I put the peg in it. But I can go ahead and poke a hole in my can and slip this in through, and then I can measure off the rod, and uh, I probably could almost go ahead and line up the neck and everything too, but uh, I'll go ahead and make my hole in my can and take a look at how this neck fits to that can and what I need to do there. And then I'm going to quit because the sun's coming out and it's warming up and there's so many things I want to do outside in the sunlight. So this is good. It gave me something to do while I was waiting for the day to warm up a bit. Without, uh, And then now I can go out and play in the, play in the sun. Ooh boy! Some of these old cans don't punch like some of the new ones. This one is a good example of that. And rather than bang on it too much, I decided to drill it out. Sometimes I wind up having to do a little body work to hide my to hide my sins. So, I think I'm going to stop here. That is basically almost how she's going to sit. I'm going to change the angle a little bit, but you're starting to begin to see a little bit of what it's going to look like. I might touch up, since I painted this can, I might touch up that rough spot where I made it a little ugly there with my hammer and around on it. But, that's a pretty good start on it, I believe. Now I'm going to make me a rod that's just long enough to pass through the bottom of the can. I'll use that to get the angle of my neck correct. Woohoo!